have a look at this beautiful gummy. It says gummy shark is flake. So down here in Victoria, beautiful eating fish. As you can see, if Coops rolls him over, look at all the stuff he's been eating in there. He's been eating heaps of crap. Look at that. Look at that stew. Been eating tons of stuff. So what we're going to do now, and this is a really important part. Got to get his head off. Got to get the head off. So it's really important. Why do we do that, Stu? Get the blood out of him. Get the blood out. Eyes, uh, so it's a little bit gruesome, but what it is, you cut the gills out, and you get a little nine year out. And what a lot of guys do is they cut it behind the neck, or behind the head, I should say, and just leave it. What you can see there is she's cut it off completely. That is it. So it's gut and gill and straight on ice. And that's how you get beautiful gummy shark. And this thing, oh, still one of my favorite eating fish. So he's processed basically what? Within a minute or two of being in the boat? As quick as possible. And the job's done. And look how excited Jess is. Woo! Yeah. And I know everyone poo poo, so everyone's where everyone goes, oh, oh it's stinky old gummies, they're horrible, you know, you know, shark fishing. But down here in Victoria, they are it's still one of my favourite. Beer battered gummy, yum. So the most important thing to get out. So here, yeah, see that? That blood. Move the tail up, Jess. There. See that blood along there? Along the up the ridge line there? Just get that out. And, give him a, and we'll dip him over the side. And now he's ready for processing. So now you can process it. Or we'll put it on ice, I should say. So it's ready for processing later. And look at that all beautiful that, and clean. All clean that, inside. All nice and clean. So the ammonia's out, the blood's out. Cooper's down there working on a Stu's um, banjo shark. And banjo sharks are actually a good thing out here because they like that gravel ground, what the gummy's like. And he's going straight in the yeti. So what we're gonna do is show you how to clean a gummy. First up, doing the gummy. Coops is being a great help. So we're gonna show you how to do a gummy. And how are we doing this, Stu? What's the deal? So you've cut off the head, explain what you did first. So we've um, taken the head off guts out and cleaned all the um, blood line out of the um, out of the gut cavity and then next is we cut the fins off what's that just for making it easy of cleaning? easier to, to, to fillet it and to skin it so cut all the fins off and what's the importance of taking all when you clean it initially taking all the guts out and getting the blood out of them so they, they don't get the, the taste of the ammonia and you have to do that really fast, don't you? Really quickly. When you hit the hit the um, gummy on the head, and then um, get the guts out of it. And so here, if you can, when you're taking these fins off, you just take a slither of skin like that. All right. So you've done it all the way. Yep. There's the fin there, that section there, and you've taken this. And what's the deal there? So that makes it easier to skin when you're ah, taking the skin yeah. off. The same with this one. The learning keeps? Yes. Same goes. And you hold the fin and pull it back so it makes the skin taut. So you can you can run the knife up. You go right up as far as you can. As far as you can. To the, to the top fin. Like that. So yeah. now you've got in the bottom fin. You can do it with this one, but it's not as important. Just while we're doing that, keeps. Did you just fall over a brick? No. <laughs> That's my boat chocky fill over. And again, you try and get it all the way up there, just get yep. it all the way up. So that's all the fins down. So, and then to take the fillet off, you can see the cartilage is just there. Yep. So you rest the knife on top of the cartilage. And the knife will sit just on top of the cartilage. And you just skin down. You just fill it down. So they're pretty easy fish to clean, Very aren't they? easy to clean. So what's the one what's the biggest problem you see? You've caught thousands and thousands of gummies. What's the biggest problem you've seen? Oh people it's, people not um getting the blood out of them. So that's that's the critical part. Gotta cut the head off, gotta get the guts out as soon as you can. Take photos, but take them quickly, and then um get the guts out and the head off. So how quick was I getting the photos of you with your 
It was very quickly. Usually you take about an hour. Fish <laughs> just half dead by the time we get in the water. Just have to work it and work it. So that's the two fillets. So that's it, and that's just. So that's, that's your cartilage. discard. Yep. So there's really nothing left nothing on that left little on bit. That. As you can see, it's, it's just the cartilage, isn't it? So, so what, what's the next step? So now you got your so fillet out. What I out. do is I cut the belly flap off. Like that. You don't have to, but it just makes it a bit easier to skin. Mm -hmm. And then from the tail section, they're so working put the it, tail up. Put it right on the edge of the bench, so you you got plenty of room for the knife. Oh, so you can slide the knife along down here. Yep, just cut a tiny yep. bit of the meat, get the knife to go along the skin, and just pull so the skin. So you're pulling, yep. Pull the skin. Built to fall. Check all those lighting there while he's doing it. Oh, yeah. And then all the way up. And it works pretty well. At, all the way at, up. Yep, and that's. So that's the skin, and you. S there you go. Look at that. One the prime bit of gummy, and oh, there's a tiny yeah. bit of cartilage, which you'll see. Just there. So if you miss that, and that's that generally there, that little bit. That's always there. Yep. And then for the belly flap, you don't waste that because it's gummy. Yep. Yeah, you never you do waste exactly any. the same. That's done. It's a tiny, missed a tiny bit there, which is normal. So yeah, so it's not, it's, it's not always perfect. There'll be little bits that just you can always fix just it. trim them out. There's a beautiful piece of gummy shark. So same goes with this side. We'll go through it again for everyone that hasn't seen it. Or well, just a, a recap. Take the um, belly flap comes off. Belly flap off. Tail side down. And just pull the skin. You can pull pull the skin tight and just cut. And you're working it almost, aren't you? Yeah. I mean this is my whiting knife. It's, if I had a bigger flatter blade, it'd be better. Yep. But you know, you can still do it with a whiting knife. So if you turn it over, there's a little bit oh, of cartilage that little again. Bit. Yep, a little bit of cartilage there. Cut that off. And there you have it. Beautiful gummy fillet. Do the belly flap, which is here. Oh, yep. Whilst she does that and trims that, this is your waist. Like, it is nothing. Look at it. A bit of skin, a few fins, no shark finning over here, thank God. And your cartilage. And that's it. And obviously your head and guts are gone over the side. Yep. So right there. So Coops, what's the one thing, oh. while you're annoying the dog, <laughs> that you would say... Come around. So Coops, what's the one thing you've learned... For the gummy shark. <laughs> Look at Stu. Get out of my garden. Get out of the garden, you bloody idiot. Dig out my tomatoes. Yeah. Just so Hey, wait. Come on. Get out of it. Rightio. Okay. Try again. What's the one thing, what's the priority for gummies apart from actually catching them? Cutting the head off. Getting that blood out, getting the guts out. Because that pneumonia will ruin the bloody, um, the meat. And, I mean, flip. You don't want bad flake. Flake's too good to waste. So there you go. Yeah. And if you're not going to do that, just let them go. So there you go. You heard from the experts. And me. Experts. 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 Expert. Expert over there. Right. Do that. So get them out and get it done really quick. That's the priority. And then it's delicious. Yep. You want to do the flathead? Gummy for dinner.